guys, welcome to the 2023 Hourglass Challenge. This is a four week program focusing on your core and your glutes. The full schedule is on my website and there's five brand new episodes for this program. You can follow along these workouts with or without using weights. Now drop me a comment down below and let's get into the workout. We've got 18 exercises across two sets in this upper body workout, 30 to 45 seconds of exercises with 15 to 30 seconds of rest in between. If you don't have dumbbells, it's totally okay, just follow the same movement. You are still gonna work up a sweat and if you're using weights, start with a set of lighter weights and increase it the next time you do this workout. Stand up right and let's get started. Lean forward with a slight bend on your knee, keep your back straight while holding your dumbbells, then pull your dumbbells up behind you, working your back and lats. We're doing 9 exercises in this first set, then repeating them again in the second set. If you're a beginner or just getting back into it, go at your own pace in the first set. Rest up when you need to and then we'll push hard in the second set. Fifteen seconds rest here and move on to lateral raises. Stand upright and lift your dumbbells up laterally with a slight bend on your elbows. Lift with your elbows until your hands are about shoulder height. You should feel your shoulder muscles working here. I know a lot of you don't like doing upper body workouts, but building your shoulders and lats can help you build towards an hourglass figure if that's what you're looking for. Rest up everyone, shoulder press is next. Make sure you're picking the right weight and you're not using something too heavy or too light. I recommend starting with lighter weights if you're new to working out, then increasing it progressively as you do the workout again. Start with the dumbbells above your shoulders, then press upwards, then bring them back down slowly. Fifteen seconds rest once again, and we'll move on to rear delt fly. Have your feet about hip width apart, then bend forward with a slight bend on your knee. Lift your weights up, squeezing your shoulder blades together, all while keeping your back nice and straight. Great work everyone, we're halfway through the first set. Renegade row is next, so get ready to go in a high plank position. While holding your dumbbells in a high plank position, lift one dumbbell up, alternating between both sides. You can have your knees on the mat if it's too hard to stay in a high plank. This is all that I do How could you act like you never met me Been a while since I 
Flip around onto your back and we'll move on to tricep press in a bit. While laying flat on your mat with your knees bent, press your dumbbells upwards and bring them back down slowly. Nice and easy. Remember to swap to heavier or lighter dumbbells depending on how your form is. You should be doing the exercise in a full range of motion with a bit of a challenge. Nice work guys, 15 seconds rest now. Stand upright and put one dumbbell aside. You just need one dumbbell for a single arm row. With your left foot forward and your left hand on your hip, bend over slightly with one dumbbell on the other hand and pull your elbow out behind you. Exhale and engage your core. No rest here, let's swap to the other side. Just one more exercise to go after this and that will be set one and we'll have a longer rest. Rest up everyone, pick up your other dumbbell and we'll have hammer curls to finish off set 1. Stand upright with dumbbells in both hands, then curl your dumbbells up by bending at the elbow. Keep your upper arm stationary. And that's set one. Pause the video here if you need a longer rest. Now we're starting set 2 shortly and repeating the same exercises from the first set. If you felt that your weights were too light, you could swap to heavier weights. It's all about making adjustments and pushing yourself further each time. Until there's no way left to go. Similar to before, pull your elbows up behind you and focus on using your lats. Fifteen seconds rest once again, and we'll move on to lateral raises. Lift your dumbbells up until they're about shoulder height, then lower them down slowly and repeat.
Rest up guys, shoulder press is next. Press your dumbbells up and lower them down slowly. Rest and shake off those muscles and get ready for rare delt fly coming up. Make sure your back is straight and work your back muscles. Nice work everyone, 15 seconds rest here and then we're going back down on your mat for Renegade Row. While in a high plank position, lift one dumbbell up then the other side. Just 4 more exercises to go and we'll be done with the workout. Keep pushing through guys! Nice work guys, 15 seconds rest now. We'll flip onto our backs for tricep press. Oh, you got me in my feelings. Yeah, you got me in my mind. Press your dumbbells upwards and bring them back down slowly. Do it slow and controlled and be safe. When I'm sober, yeah. Trying to get you out of my head, babe. Yeah, you got me in my mouth. So, thoughts on my mind, not a call, say. I'm burning for you, supernova. It's not on purpose, don't make me nervous. Voices in my head, push them to the side. It's not on purpose, don't you make me nervous. Voices in my head, push them to the side. To the side, to the side of my mind. You're doing great guys, stand upright and put one dumbbell aside while holding the other one and single arm row is next. Draw your elbow up behind you, engage your core and focus on pulling up the dumbbells with your lats. I just wanna know what you think and let me in and pull me closer. Uh, need another shot. No rest here, let's swap over to the other side. Just one more exercise to go after this, so don't quit on us now. You got this. It's not on purpose, you make me nervous. Voices in my head, 
him to the side It's not on purpose You make me nervous Voices in my head Push him to the side To the side, to the side In my mind To the side, to the side In my mind It's not on purpose You make me nervous Final rest of the workout. Pick up the other dumbbell and let's finish off with hammer curls. Make sure your upper arm stays stationary. And that's the workout guys, great work on reaching the end of the workout. Leave me a comment down below if you finished this workout and remember to hit that like button for me and I'll see you in the next workout. Bye!